All right, Bill. Um, I tell you what, you guys got a great facility here. Uh, what uh, what kind of makes your what makes the Infinity Cheer All Stars unique? Um, well, some of the things that we try to do, I don't know that it would necessarily be unique nationwide, but unique to this area. Uh, you know, when when like I said, my original background was from other sports, football, uh, wrestling, things where. Um, not necessarily wrestling, but football, basketball, stuff where you tried out for positions. And, uh, you know, I looked at cheerleading and the way tryouts were done, and it just seemed to, it just didn't make any sense to me of how you took people that, that clearly there were different positions. You had flyers, you had bases that, that did different roles, yet everybody tried out the same exact way. So you end up with teams where maybe you have no flyers or you're lacking back spots or sides or, you know, you just don't have the right combination of kids. So, you know, one of the things we did here was we completely changed how we did tryouts or how we formed teams. Um, we would do, we would separate it into flyer tryouts, into, into bases and try to fill roles the same way a football team looks for quarterbacks, running backs, uh, kickers. Uh, that's one of the things that, that I think uh, set us apart here. And, and you know, it, it's taken some getting used to for the schools. There's still a lot of the old guard that are just used to doing it their, the old way. Um, but as they're seeing that, you know, you put together the combination, you know, and, and really try, may have a trout that makes sense for the sport itself, that you can put together far better teams. So we're trying to kind of educate the schools in that, and uh, that's something that I think has helped our program and been able to put together squads that have been successful, even though we're an we're extremely small gym. Uh, we're always competing against girls that are older than us. So, you know, the combination of, of putting the right kids together is, is essential for us to do well. All right. Now, um, what, I mean, how do you get the kids in here? I mean, obviously, you guys got kind of a unique tryout process. Um, you know, like I said, the, the, the masses of the numbers aren't here as compared to a big metropolitan area. Um, I mean, how do you get them in the gym? How do you get them hooked on competitive cheerleading? It's it's word of mouth. I, I wish we had a large marketing budget. You know, we simply don't. Uh, one of the best ways is if you can get in front of the schools. You know, a big thing in a small town is parents like their kids to be seen uh, at, at football games at the schools. Hey, so if you can get you know, uh, maintain good relationships with coaches, uh, school administrators, uh, principals, then you can, you can be part of their halftime shows. Um, you may be able to go to the local college, uh, do the, one of their basketball games and be involved in, in a halftime, uh, and throw your routines or pieces of it and just get the exposure out there. Uh, and the parents show up, and that's that's one of the things they love their kids to be seen locally. And anytime you can do that, you start picking up extras where people who really don't know what it is that we were doing because they never see it, then they start to understand. Hey, well, you know, my daughter's good. Maybe you know I want her doing that because her school team's not doing that stuff. So you know, the biggest part is we need the community to see us. You know, and to see what level we're doing and how much more we're doing compared to, you know, if, you know, somebody just doing regular school cheerleading. And school cheerleading's fine, but it's different. They've got to do, you know, they're there to do cheers and support the team where we're all about skills, all about tumbling, all about stunts. And, uh, and we compete when, when we get to compete. It's all about the girls. You know, it's not about them supporting other people. It's, it's their time. And, um, you know, when we get when we show people that and we can get out in front of them, um, that's been our, our real way to grow. That's great. That's, that's, that's great. Thank you.